Hello everybody and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more Unicorn Overlord and uh, yeah, we just finished another fight. We recruited, um, what was her name? Uh, Clive's girlfriend. <laughs> His old wife-to-be. Um, we're going to have to put them in a unit together, right? Like, we have to do that. We'll figure that out in a minute. <laughs> The path ahead leads to our border with Bastorius, the snowbound nation to the north. It's mostly beastrels who live in its lands, beast folk by another name. They're an insular people though, and don't warm easily to outsiders. Take care if you find yourself there, especially when the glow of the moon adorns the sky. Okay, so werewolf type stuff, sounds like. Now I'm still hoping to find... At least one more... What is it? Like a church or something, right? The cemeteries, that's what it is. Come back whenever you please, fair knights. My dad says we were saved by some nice people from, um, the Limberation? That must be you, right? Yeah, that's me. Damn right, kid. Monica, that's her name. Alright, we're gonna station Monica Allow here. Me, my, prince. my dad said life here's gotten a lot better lately. Thanks for everything. You've shown us that no matter how dire the situation, life can improve. I'll not forget that lesson. Okay. All right, let's work our way backwards. Let's make sure there's nothing hidden down here. Ooh, how do we get to that? All right, noted. We'll try and find that pathway, huh? There it is. It doesn't matter to us common folk who's sitting on the throne. All we can really do is follow their rule. These woods were a real bandit's nest until just recently. Someone must have chased them off and thank the father for that. All right. So we've got enough to do this. And a little bit extra. Alright, so we need 10 to do the next upgrade, right? Yeah, okay. Um, we only have one more to unlock after this. Okay, once we have 10, we'll be able to rank that up. And it'll probably still be a while. We have to get to rank A before we can get from 4 to 5, so... Is that true, or was it B? I think it was A. Okay. So yeah, it'll be a while. Radiant knights like myself are capable of completely negating magic attacks. Command me to cover allies who are weak to magic, and your units will be stronger for it. Care for a demonstration? Okay. Alright, that group is definitely doing the best. Now, Colm might be covering some bases here, but what would happen if I switched you for somebody who has some armor slaying capability with Virginia? Does that change anything? Ooh, we're getting a little closer. All right, let's analyze it. I'm guessing the debuffs are still necessary. Give in. The attack down isn't making that much of a difference, I don't think, so... My charge fulfilled. I think I have our solution. Here's what we're gonna do. We can bring in somebody like Morden. Oh, it's still not there, huh? Okay. 
Hmm. Now, Morden does technically have a little bit better attack, right? Oh, no, she's actually better. I wonder if she has better initiative or something. Okay, we definitely need her. You may not be doing as much as we want you to, though. What if we just did two of these guys? They're all 416! That's ridiculous. On your toes. The guard seal, yeah. I can help. Yeah, guard yeah. seal, dude. Whenever you get a kill for that? It looks like he does. If you're unable to cast magic on a hoplite, attacks from a warrior may also prove effective. In any case, magical attackers are a dire threat to a great many classes. I suggest you turn to us instead of leaving those classes unprotected. Attack a single enemy grants a user plus one AP if the target is defeated. Yep. Cool. Very cool. Okay. That was huge. Alright, this is where those bandits were. So I don't think there's anything for us to get down here. Lots of resources. Is it all scrap metal? Okay, not all. Don't mind me. Bro hasn't noticed yet. The rebels here? After we just bought the place off Sonoira 2. But this is no time to doubt ourselves. We've only one choice, and that's to fight. The battle for plane. Okay, level 14. We might actually be able to do this, but I almost want... I almost want to go into uh, Drakenhold. The rebels, good thing I hired those thieves to back me up. Okay, the battle for Riviere. 13. All right, this group is doing pretty well. In this case, it's mostly Fran, I think. Wow, yeah, it must be all Fran. Can't believe that killed both of them. I'm kind of impressed. Ha! Got it first! And what are you gonna do about it, huh? Let's have some fun. Lay down! Yeah. Better heal up. Yeah, it's gonna be another one of those challenge maps. The sigils. One wonderful fortune, we've come across a new sigil. Now then allow me to activate its power. Moderate one. Okay, everything's kind of a similar level over here.
<laughs> well, I'm just bypassing everybody. Oh, and this connects over here. Gotcha. Closer. Yeah, having somebody else in the front to help support and block for Miriam, I think, is probably going to be a good call most of the time. Man, this is such a good grouping, too, and they're not quite getting it done. Um, let's see where our shortcoming is and see if there's an easy solution. Everybody in this group has so many, like, action points and shit, I feel like, that... Got me good. Be restored. Maybe somebody like Morden, if he can get that assaulting attack that gives him AP again, that could actually turn this battle. Cheer up. We mustn't grow careless. Go on, come at me. Alright, so who do we switch out? You're doing a great job of tanking, and I feel like that might change if we switch you out, but let's just see what happens if Morden comes in instead. Yeah, that's kind of what I thought. Alright, if Morden took the place of... you. Yeah, okay. If he's able to get those kills with that mighty swing or whatever it's called, what, what is that called? Uh, assaulting blow. Then he'd be able to r smash these guys up, but it doesn't seem to be playing out that way. Might be because of the initiative order. There we go. Yeah, Miriam was the weak link there in this matchup. That must have hurt. Oh, did you, like, have one HP or something? Why didn't he disappear? Rebel fools, Bistorius belongs to us now and you'll never have it back. So it seems like you could get into Bistorius early if you were able to do this early, but level 25 is definitely beyond us. All right, well, cool. All right, we got a bunch of fights up here that we can do eventually, but I think at this point, I want to go back down here, and we'll start. Uh, we'll start going into Drakenhold. Try to steal this town from under my nose, will you? I assure you, it won't come easy. The Battle for Vesite? The Liberation Army sets out to defeat Bernolt and free Vesite town from Zenoiran rule. Hold on, I'm gonna have to write this one down because I'm not gonna be able to spell it. The Battle for... Vesite. Keep giving it, like, a German pronunciation. I don't know if that's correct, but... And this is a level 10. This this will probably feel easy to us at this point. <laughs> All right.
Okay, Minette and Nina are the only ones left out at the moment. Maybe we can try something like that there. All right, for you. Mostly I just want Clive and uh, Monica here to be in the same unit together. Well, let's see, Melisandre's in that group, right? No, that's Leah. Let's switch them and then we'll put Colm back in. Um, because Colm and Melisandre, they almost certainly have um, a rapport together. do that. Take less damage from ranged assists. You have much higher speed, though. Okay, having you be leader is fine. Recover HP and stamina faster when garrisoned. We get some passive healing from her. Take less damage from magic assists. I ride for Cornea. I shall never fail. Your vigor fades. With my aid, your strength fails you. Seems we've done it. Freaking cavalry group over now. here. A worthy foe. Okay. So you got a heavy smasher in the back there, so we'll want to be careful of that. Um, let's go ahead and do Fran's unit here. Fran and Chloe will be good against uh, the, the mounted units. Nowhere is too far. Yeah, Sir. obliterated. I'll prove my worth. It shall be done. I'm looking at, like, average low-level groupings right now. We've got a level 10 in there with Morden, and a level 11 with Virginia. This group has some low levels as well. Just tell me if anyone needs... what is it? Ooh, that's a bad group against them. <laughs> Never it. mind. No mercy! Love that. Victory is ours. I stand ready. Okay, you guys are doing pretty poor against that grouping as well. Understood. 
What shall I do? Um, I don't want you to accidentally run into the boss yeah. right now. By the fathers, I'll help however I can. I'm retreating for now. All right, what is this grouping? So these guys. Um, all right, so there's a guy in the back, and then these guys can replenish. So you need dodge tanks, right? Because otherwise, if they're able to activates before being hit by a melee attack, negate melee damage for a single hit, grants the user plus one AP, and then keen edge. Attack a single enemy with a first strike. Okay. So those passive points basically equate to three action points, right? But if they miss us... No, it has true strike. So you don't want to dodge tank. I don't remember what the counter for these guys is. People who can take hits, I guess. Tanks? Militia fights. Who's my target? Hmm. Pretty good magic defense. So, physical defense is low, magic defense is something? high. This is Understood. a very magic focused group. Well, not very. Not at this point. What's but... next? Prepare yourselves. We ride. Be good. Ease your pain. Ouch. A flawless victory. Victory. I'll prove my worth. Man, this group doesn't do terrible against them. I depart. I'm ready. A temporary retreat. This group would probably do pretty well. They will be ours. <clears throat> Onward. Nowhere is too far. They do a lot of damage, but they take a lot of damage too. Once we get rid of like one or two in the front line, I feel like we can do a little better. I'm ever in your service. We march. At your service. I'll prove my worth. What does this do? Visibility in an area, rendering enemy units detectable. Okay, so if you're going through a forest. All right, there's nothing I really want to use there. Just wanted to check. I shall never fail. <laughs> hey, the no crits on this is actually probably helping us quite a bit. I didn't even think about that, but yeah. So Sylvie does help a lot with those guys. I still bear faith. It's always so interesting when you come back and it's completely different. Zero damage, huh? Okay. Can I do anything to change that? Aid. 
So it was because of all the parries, we were hitting the same guy. Um, so in other words, going for the lowest HP, well, huh, I don't know. Your villainy ends here. I mean, 147 to two, I think we're doing okay there. Quite the challenge. I'm gonna let you guys get a little experience. It'll leave you worse for wear, but that's okay. Good stuff. Thanks for running those brutes out of here. With the hurt you put on them, I doubt the bastards will be coming back anytime soon. Damn right. The Draken Seabream. Okay, we'll work on finding more of those. You won't find finer weapons all right. in all of Hole. Attack a single enemy and inflicts physical defense minus 30. Okay, a piercing bow. So, yeah. That's interesting. So you can have gear that'll make your bow users better at, you know, armor crushing. Aerial guard. Activates before being hit by a physical attack. Block an enemy attack with a medium guard. Becomes a heavy guard. And grants the user plus one PP if the enemy is flying. I love that these allow for very, very specific builds. The only problem is, is that I'm not the type of person to micromanage to that level. So it's probably not something I'm going to utilize all that often. Things that are like so specific to being like, okay, well, I know this unit's going to be going up against a whole bunch of flyers. So give them this shield for this fight. Like I'm generally somebody who likes to find gear that is a little bit more universally useful and then just stick with that. Something that's going to be on average useful all the time rather than only some of the time. Um, mostly that's just because I don't like to spend a great amount of time switching around gear. Um, and also I forget that I have these pieces of gear. So I would buy this and I'd forget I had it and never use it, you know what I mean? So that's just a thing that goes on in my brain. Um, but I know a lot of people are gonna really like doing a lot of that build uh, creation. Activates before an ally attacks, grants 30% physical attack for an ally's next. It's kind of cool, too. Inspiration. Buff an ally with their next attack, grants 30% attack, 50% critical damage, and minus 50 accuracy. I don't like trade-offs. <laughs> don't like trade-offs either. How are we doing Got on items? On My wares won't disappoint. You got a deal. Your coins will. All right. Desert's got more bandits than sand these days. Mostly old military hands and washed up knights gone rogue. Well, with all the gambling around Drake and Hold, some folks lose everything and turn to a life of crime. A lot of sandstorms out in the desert. It's hard to see in one of those, so be careful. Noted. Thanks again for chasing Zenoira out of here. Well, like I said, these are my old stomping grounds. How about I give you the grand tour? All right, show us around. Beyond the swirling sands. 
Oh, the Grand Tour involves a fight. Oh, good. <laughs> All right, so we got Wyverns, we got Witches, we got Gladiators. Beyond the Swirling Sands, Drakenhold's Desert is a dangerous land of exiles and criminals as well as the place Albin grew up. Worried for those he cares about, Albin asks Elaine to survey the desert and offers to act as his guide. It's just as Aubin said. We should have no trouble passing safely. And we finally have a clean source of water. This oasis is a godsend amidst all this sand. Hey, he's back. What news do you bring? All sorted. We're fine long as we're here. Meaning we're not fine everywhere else. Sorry to say it after all the hot air I talked, but... Yep. Turns out we got a problem. How so? Well, you know how I said I got an in here? Old bandit pal of mine by the name of Magellan. Guy practically runs the place. And he does it well. He's, he did. Rumor has it, he's a whole different man now. Don't know what happened to him, but he's been picking fights with other gangs for the past six months. That sounds awfully familiar. Can't say for sure, but Zenoira probably got to him. Is there no way to avoid conflict? Not if I can't work something out. Anyone steps foot on his land and they're as good as buried. But I'm not stopping until I know what happened to him. Why he's doing this? Mine making a little detour to his keep? The choice is yours, as long as you're the one charting the course. And if Magellan is under Zenoira's control, we may just be able to loosen the spell. Uh, listen up, boss. We got two roads here. You can take to the Bandit's Keep. The way up north is full of sorcerers, magic types, turned over to the thieving life. Southern Route, on the other hand, has got some of the toughest outlaws you ever see. From what I hear, the two sides have been going at it ever since Magellan flipped. Then there's the ruins up north, barely claimed by a knight gone rogue. Rumor has it they've been causing the town all sorts of problems. Oh, and here. Some light feathers, ooh, to help us through the sands. These sands will slow us down good, but use one of these and it'll be like you're back on solid ground. Just so you know, my prince, flying units like mine won't be affected by the desert either. Do that, do with that what you will. Uh, thank you both. I suppose all that remains now is to deploy. Uh, real quick first, we should be sending archers against that wyvern, yeah? You would expect as much, but the shield their fighter bears will render that tactic, frankly, powerless. Well, in that case, why not send in a sorcerer instead? Wyvern knights are equally as vulnerable to magic as they are to arrows. Huh, I had no idea. Let's give it a shot, Elaine. Okay, this was a level 11 mission, so these guys are a little bit weaker, right? Yeah. Okay, so flyers will be useful, no doubt. Okay, so you're one of the groups that's gonna go out. This group may not be as useful right now, like they said. We could use you as a flyer. Do we have three or four that we can start with? Four. Okay. You for sure. Cornea. 
judgment shall strike them. Just tell me if anyone needs healing. Okay, that's gonna be our starting squad. At once. Do you need a healer? Setting off. Yeah, we've got more than one group coming at you. What is it? How are you doing against them? Fine. How are you doing against them? Eh. I understand. Either way, you can protect it. Back for more, are you? Damned barbarians don't know when to quit. This desert is ours and we are never handing it over. Baron San Hammer Bear, and here I thought you magic types were supposed to be smart. The only people we listen to are the ones who have got the strength to win. Time to find out if that's what you are or not. I'm here. Face me and be cut down. I'll not go. Stand before you're me. You're nothing. <laughs> you truly, you're nothing. This group is destroying them. I can help. I'm here to help. Forgive me. Winter. Damn, Fran. I did it. It seems you've misjudged me. No mercy. Go on, then. No. Don't you kill my girl Yana? How dare you? My training's paid off. Nowhere is too far. At your service. Understood. Damn it, I can't see my own feet through all this sand. Ah, uh, those bandits will be on us in no time flat. Get to the watchtowers. Visibility will be better if you get a little height. You heard the man, let's get moving, Elaine. You'll not be disappointed. I take Okay, I'm gonna skies. send that group to do that. You're nothing. Any who bar my path must perish. Behold! How embarrassing. <laughs> A temporary fix. I'm here to help. I shall protect you! As it was written. May the Father watch over us. Okay. Yep, the two mage groups will continue forward. At once. They train upon me. That's so rude. <laughs> Never seen you out in the dunes before. Think of this as a little toll for crossing. Anyway, thanks for doing business. Hey, come back here, you thief. Try sending a flying unit after him, your highness. We can move through the sand just as easily as anywhere else. I mean, I've already got them moving. Understood. I'm ever in your Maybe service. on this group we will use one of those light tail feathers. That's the one. No, we were given a light feather. Doubles mobility for 30 seconds. What shall I do? I stand ready, sir. I'm ever in your service. It shall be they ready in attack. That's so rude. Nowhere is too far. Prepare yourself. No mercy. Um, I should have checked my setup. I may have been able to reduce some of the 
pain we're going to be feeling here. Are you okay? Dead and buried. My yeah, that was kind of brutal. I stand ready. Understood. What shall I do? I depart. Oh, glad that's cleared up. Hey, no relaxing just yet. You never know when the next one's gonna roll in. Try and remember where the enemies are at. Now, before it's too late. Okay. Alright, so we got these guys coming. Okay. Face me and be cut down! Yeah, I should have taken out the tower first. Healing. Take notes, Lex. I have to catch my breath. I fear I'm fading. Man, what a waste of item utilization, though. I've arrived. Stand before me. I thought we were doing better against these guys. Clearly, we're not. Okay, what are we looking at here? Um, scout with lowest HP with assaulting lance. Then it's checking if own HP is low. I'm gonna get rid of that one. That one complicates it a little more than necessary. So, Wild Rush is probably gonna be the one that happens. Let's see if it changes anything if I just have Assaulting Lance. If he's, like, getting one-shot kills, then he'll just continually gain AP. I think that is better. did the only damage there. Prepare yourselves. Yeah, that one's a little bit too much. Let's go 75%. That early miss that Clive had actually cost us quite a bit in that last fight. A flawless victory! A worthy foe. I'll prove my worth. Okay. At your service. Okay, until you're fully rested, I can't even check that. I'm ever in your service. It shall be done. What shall I do? did it um, you're not gonna be ready in time I'll make my mark no I truly need you what to you move need? buddy I'll see what I can do Careful, you may get burnt. Grace, guys. A chance to earn some praise. I must stand. Careful, you may get burnt. In 
Oh, these misses hurt. We need some true strikes. Freaking thieves. Is that all those guys I'll are going to do? They might be. The day will be ours. The time is at hand. Onward. What do you need? I'll see what I can do, as you directed. A chance to earn some praise. Ever weaker! I shall ease your pain. I'll make my mark. Oh, I must have seen that wrong. I thought it was a kill. I'm listening. Yes, I concur. This should be it. Take cover! Former strength. At your service. Sir. Come then. Alright, these thieves aren't Wanna too tough. grows ever closer. <laughs> to me. Now they won't help these guys, right? I wonder. I guess we're gonna find out real quick, aren't we? You'll not be disappointed. Don't want you to go up against that we guy, march. probably. Yeah. You face me. Let's have some fun. Everything in service of my people. <clears throat> Onward. Face me and be cut down. Okay, so with the magic assist. High swing right now is prioritizing cavalry. Those don't exist right now, so. Prioritize front row. Prioritize back row since they're supporting. Okay, the back row is going to be the better option. What else do we got? The 
attack two enemies with magic. All right, so if I did magic missile, similar to that, except what I'm gonna do is also prioritize back row. 124. This has slightly less magic potency. What if Ice Bolt was on top? No. Now, you won't be able to get back row stuff. Um, you're gonna be doing your javelin, so you're already probably doing the best thing you can do. Taking a lot less damage now. I can help. My magic is yours. Good dodge. Very good. Uh, wait, please, I surrender. Uh, yeah, could have sworn you'd put up more of a fight than that. Uh, we would if if you weren't here. Listen, Albin, something's wrong with Magellan. Not sure what it is, but if anyone could put a stop to it, it's you. I'll ask our friends up north to lend a hand myself. As for the bandits down south, well, that's on you. So, what do you say? We have a deal? I wonder if she's gonna betray us, but... Let's, let's play it out. Well, if it means not having to... Having blades at each other's throats, I'm all for it. Come on, Elaine. But of course, what would you have us do, Fair Rider? Only one thing, keep me safe while I'm flying over there. Can't exactly have my chat if I'm burnt to crisp, so... Okay, did you get a heal after that? Because if not, then um, you're in bad shape. Okay, she is healed. Oop, can't tell where you're actually at. <laughs> Understood. I'll make my mark. All right, I'd love to keep you safe. I'm gonna have to rest. If I take this though, I might be able, I'll send her and I'll see if I can pull out another person to assist you. I've already got some people here that might be able to come north to also assist. So we have options, is what I'm saying. Come then. I'll not go. You face me. I think we're. I think we're missing some of these. Keep going. Got a bad roll. Villainy ends here. At least try. <laughs> Not finished yet. <laughs> Better heal up. Embarrassing. What a joke. We 
on my time. A fine bout. We march. The path is set. Any who bar my path must perish. Ungodly fool. You know what I did in the north that I messed up on? I think there was a uh, camping spot up there. We could have replenished uh, using that. Nothing to fear. I'll never hold myself back. Is that true or am I making that up? Nope, there's definitely one right there. <laughs> okay. I'll take it off your hands. Stealing our gold, are you? Well, I guess nobody's got it easy these days. Let's just call it a little thank you for sparing my life. At your service. At once. I stand ready. You face me. Want to keep going? Not a chance! Another step forth. Well fought. Your will shall witness the might of an angel. We'll ignore that for now. <clears throat> Onward. You'll not be disappointed. For the liberation. Alright, we should be fine. There's nobody in between us at the moment. Oh, I can't spawn anybody from there. Hey boss, we have company. More mon more moths to the flame, hmm? Fine then, let's show them what we do with interlopers. Alright, we need her to get to her, so we don't want to actually take down the boss, correct? I'm listening. Um, you're close. I've arrived. What is it? For the honor of Hasmeye. Oh, whoops. I for you. wanted to switch the I'm leader. Yours. Leave everything All to right. me. That was dumb. <laughs> I'll make my mark. Of course. Witness the might of an angel. We march. To me. Quite well, Elaine. You'll not be disappointed. I take to the skies. Your villainy ends here. Let's have some fun. This will hurt! I'll help. I can't fail my sacred mission. I've need of a rest. Don't I know it? Blasphemous fool! I have you! Be safe! Momentum is with us! Greater strength to keep Sharon safe. Witness the might of an angel. Might just let that guy go? You'll not be disappointed. I depart. What do you need? All right, we only have two more items left, so... I'll help however I can. The Cornian militia fights on. Who's my target? Heading there now. Do you need a healer? They 
the service of the royal f what would you ask by your word i'll help however i can i'll ride any distance how can i assist i ride at once Is ours. I'll be taking that. Really say the word. Okay, it's not the best matchup there. Do you need something? Understood. How can I assist? Consider it done. What a pitiful end. So much for talking. Sorry, Albin, doesn't look like we're getting any more help today. Oh, what? And what, that's supposed to be a problem? We'll take Magellan down ourselves if we've gotta. I didn't realize that she was dying there. I didn't even think to check her health. Damn it. All right. Yeah, we're gonna restart. Okay, so this is where we're going to end this episode. We're going to try this again. Um, I want to try and do this optional sort of thing that we're doing here. If we can get all of them on our side, I don't know what's going to happen, but could be cool. So I kind of, I'm my curiosity's got the better of me. I want to figure it out. So uh, thank you all for being here. Don't forget to uh, like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next episode where we're going to try this again. Um, we'll probably do something similar. I'm gonna try and be a little bit smarter with the way that my, um, item usage goes. I was a little bit, I mean, I had four uses in one go just because I screwed up a little bit and was being not very careful. Um, so we can be a little bit more efficient there for one. And for two, I feel like I can push my group up there a little bit harder to deal with the people who are going after that mage. Um, I didn't realize that she was getting blasted up there. <laughs> so yeah, thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye. I'd like to give a very special shout-out to my patron supporters, Darren York, ZTD, Knife Namase, Kyle the Monarch, Chris Murphy, JW, Quinless, Vlado101, Andy Ford, Bruce Wizzle, Black Mamba90, Eureka Gecko, A Happy Fat Panda, Turkeyfoot27, Pedo Kuto, Shadow Raven, Anna Kate the Great, The Blue Electric Cat, Emily Kuzanoa, Philip Dowdy, Timothy Jansen, Skip, and Nadia N. If you would also like to join this tier or any others, check out my memberships or my Patreon in the description down below.